I'm not asleep, but we're gonna do a really quick house apartment tour, Airbnb from before we leave to go to this gorge. Here we go. This is the living room, TV, kitchen right behind there. Onwards, show you the bathroom. Oh. <laughs> Don's in the bathroom. <laughs> I need to show you just the other room that's here, which is all one big room. Like, question about the, her room room. That's what I said. Oh. Her room's this way. This is the other room, nice bed. So it's pretty perfect. And then you can just go right this way. And you just go this way back to the living room. And that's the end of this house tour. Gonna hit the road. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. All right, it's 11 a.m. We're just leaving Pamukkale. We're just leaving Denizli. And we're heading to... Saklakent Gorge. Saklakent Gorge? Uh-huh. Saklakent Gorge. Do you know anything about Saklakan Gorge? Uh, it's the longest and deepest gorge in Turkey. Alright, it's 11 a.m. One thing I love about Turkey, just kind of can think, think in a lot of countries can go unnoticed, but I love the fact that all their gas stations have little stores where you can go and buy snacks and whatever you want, and there's a lot of them everywhere. I just love having that convenience in a country. These ones, when my feet get wet, they like slip out. No, it's We are at the Saklakent Gorge, and we're gonna go hiking for a bit, maybe go through some rough waters, and Chloe's changing her shoes because we're gonna get wet. So excited. <laughs> going up there. I think it's actually there. What? I saw a huge path going that direction. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, it's like a daytime outdoor pool party. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> of course, it seems like Turkish people really like to party. On a Monday afternoon. Eyebrows. Mm -hmm. <laughs> get it? Yep, we did it. Okay. Well, that's where I want to go. So let me just say a little bit of background on this. The hike in this gorge is really long. We didn't know that beforehand. Cohen had heard about it from some kind of travel blog, but otherwise we didn't know anything. So just bear with us as we hike through this and try and show you the cool parts of this gorge. Oh, it's so cool. That was quite the ordeal. They have a rope to help people walk, but I don't think you actually need the rope. We're risk takers. Yeah. Hell's Gate, you really need to get some water in your canyon. So much cooler if you can do that. We're gonna try to find some mud masks for our faces because I'm actually freaking out a little bit. Let's go. Really I don't know. This place is like a big crevice in the earth. Like some cracked skin. And we're walking through it. Turkey, you've outdone yourself with this gorge. This is so cool. 
I love you. a bit of a traffic jam. So at this point, the gorge uh, started getting a little boring for us and we even noticed other people were heading back. So we decided to just find some mud and put on our face and go back. But just after this, the gorge started getting narrower, the water started getting deeper, and the canyon walls just started to look a lot more cool. So as you go ahead with us and watch here, you'll see just this happening. All right, so this place is clearly cool. I think we're just gonna put mud on our face and then we'll be done. Wow. Where's what? Okay. I don't know, let's go find some. If I'm going back now, you know. all my weakness keep on linger, linger on. I'm repeat like it will be my favorite song. Oh, I know I should be moving, moving on. But you got me good, you got me good. I keep on trying to defend, still it feels like I'll pretend. Keep on driving and driving along the road to nothing. That's my head of your mind's pride between the chores and all the jobs. Just hit me and all the red lights. Keep on driving and driving. Guys, my hair. I got some. All right, put on your face. I gotta tie my hair first. Oh. Now? Yeah, okay. Did you come to Supplicate Gorge and forget to bring your sunscreen? Just stick your hands in the water? Pull us on out. Welcome to Turkey. Your water bottles? I wonder what more you can do. Right there. Stand in the light and then look up.
Look at this pool. I can't believe there's so much water in here. So this is the point where I actually had to put my camera away because the water, just as I, just after this location, goes about up to your chest. So I couldn't even carry my backpack anymore. I had to hold it over my head. And then once you go walk through the super deep water, you have to climb about a six foot waterfall. So I couldn't film any of this because I had to put the camera in my backpack, lift it over my head, and pass it to someone somehow. I forget how we did it. <laughs> but it was crazy. We almost turned back at this point. I think this is where most people turn back because it's just too hard to climb up this six foot waterfall that's you know, completely vertical. Uh, but right afterwards, I start filming again. So here we go. You come with me. I come with you. Is that going to be breakfast? Yeah, I'll okay. guard this and um, french fries and then Basically, after the hike, you can just come set at one of these cots and even <laughs> cots and tube if you want. <laughs> this place is so cool. <laughs> We just ordered some pilaf and kofta and calamari and some chips. I hope Tana's still there. I hope so too. He gets swept away. Alright, so here we go. Kai Bai Bo. Let the games begin. Okay, we're doing Kai Bai Bo. Yeah, yeah. Kai Bai. Kai Bai Bo. Kai Bai Bo. Kai Bai Bo. Jack's about to go in the cold right, water. I'm ready. I secretly wanted to go in. <laughs> Wait, take it. Okay, yeah, just do it there, but keep it pretty s still. Just in the water. Yeah. This <laughs> Actually, it Actually, feels so good. It's just my feet that are cold. Let's eat. That's it, we're just gonna drink some tea and head to our Airbnb. Okay, we're back in the car. Next shot will probably be at the Airbnb. 